again, dudes and dudettes, welcome back to I'm the Dude Games and our Uncharted 2 Among Thieves Let's Play. Um, I am absolutely sick and tired of multiplayer games. I'm absolutely sick and tired of Destiny. And it's made me want to play through games that are actually worth my time. So, let's get started where we left off in Borneo. I see it. I don't think there's any treasure around here yet. If I see any, I'll pick it up, but I'm obviously not going to get all of it. At least not on my first run through. I was getting a lot of it last episode. Here it is. I also left the detonator for you. Uh-huh. There we are. All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> <laughs> Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. <laughs> They'll never know what hit them. Just be careful. Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. It's absolutely gorgeous around here. Keep an eye out for patrols. I'm sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? <laughs> Silly USOB. Sully, you're right next to me, and yet you're using your walkie. I don't know how to take these guys out quietly. Turn around. Can you turn around? Are you capable of turning around? Yes, you are. I said quiet, mate. That's the other end loud. Ghost. Move in. It's kind of impossible to take those guys out quietly. I mean, I would have had to have gotten right up to that log there. Which way are you going? Gotcha. All right. oh, damn, I'm a good shot. Woo! Yeah, I am. Holy shit. The shooting in this one's a lot snappier than in uh, Drake's Fortune. Oh, crap. I did not know he was there. A lot snappier. Looks like we can swing across there. Maybe you can. All right, hold on, Grandpa. See if I can find another way up. Okay, I thought I spied an AK. Maybe not yet. I don't know. up here yeah I have two weapons I 
Um, question mark? Oh, here we go. That's up. Dude, you almost got hit by that. Perfect. Thanks, kid. <laughs> You're welcome, old man. This way. Nate. You should be approaching excavation site one by now. They should have been back by now. Shit, we've been spotted. Take them out fast. <laughs> Hold on, send word back to town. Oh, how's that feel? For God's sake. Okay. close to the first camp. I've planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. What else does he expect to find? Don't let Lazarevich hear you talking like that. Right. So that guy is going to be up there. If I can take some of these guys out stealthily, I will. Without drawing attention to myself too much. Kicked him in the dick! I want this guy to turn around so that way I can go up to him. Come on. You can do it. He walked back the other way before. See many other guys over there. This guy does not want to move. Maybe I have to wait for him to look the other way. I don't know. I just. This is tricky. Of course! I fucking knew, I fucking knew that was gonna happen. Shit. 
I'm gonna die, 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 god damn it! Fuck! Too many guys. We'll see about that. Handled this a little better the second time around. As per fucking usual. I... Got you. Switch cover spots with me, bud. Oh! You asshole. Where is he? You're dead. No, you're dead. Yeah, the shooting in this game is uh, a little bit more polished and refined than uh, the first game. Gotta get used to it again. We still got our arm three of the charges. Uh, is there one? There's like 190 or 30 or something rounds. You can hold for the AK in this game. They definitely so increased the, the ammo capacity as opposed to the last game. I don't want to grab that shoddy. Not yet. Oh, wait, this. I did have to arm this one. There's one more. All right. One more, and we're out of here. Now it's going to be... It's got to be back by here, I think. Yep, here it is. Okay, that's all of them. Now let's go pay Mr. Lazar at your visit. Let's see if there's anything up here first. Nope, nothing. Reaches. Come on over here, I'll give you a boost. All right. Come on, gorgeous, jump up. Yep. Uh, uh, you got a great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. There you go, kid. Why were you looking, Nate? I... It's a really weird thing to say to your mentor. Ooh, that must have been some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. Nothing up here either. Yeah, it looks that way. Well, it, oh, here's the way forward. I was like, um, let us into here. Get down. The pop is down again. Ugh. Damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe. Oh! Oh! 
Come on. Intruder. Take some of that. So difficult to try to get a hang of that. Yeah, you were doing fine. Yeah. Here's another one for you, Sully. I'm pressing triangle to counter the gr the thing. Oh, Come on, we got work <laughs> what the fuck happened there? The bodies just jumped up into the air and spazzed out for no reason. What do you bet we follow the hose? We find the camp. You always follow the hose. Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? <laughs> Sully always always follows the hose? I mean, I don't know if that's a play on words or or what. <laughs> I think I see the camp up ahead. There's absolutely zero treasure. Okay, you ready? Wait, wait, just hold on a sec. Three months and you have found nothing. Well, well, well now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. This asshole. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no, need, no need. All right then. I am surrounded by traitors and fools. What do you say we really ruined this guy's day? Do it. Do it. Kaboom. Run out! Search the perimeter! Go! All right, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. <laughs> Some fool left a sniper rifle up here. Careful, Nate. Looks like they left a couple of sentries behind. Okay, kid. It's showtime. I'm not paying us enough of this shit. Shut up with you. I'm sick of your complaining. Any other guys? I just want to make sure. Oh, shit. So it looks like it's just these last two here. I just want to make sure I can try to get... around one of them to get to the other first. If that makes sense. Because neither of them are moving and that really unnerves me. That. All right, there we go. Right. And 
now, just search the camp. Man, this Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> Here they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. They must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo was he talking about? I don't know. Well, Another cursed treasure. Here, what the hell is Lazar, it's looking for? The golden passport. Shambhala. Here in Borneo? It's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail. Back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? Now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. <laughs> You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. Eight. Well, that's convenient. The L2 held hell tabs to throw a grenade. Um, is the game fucking frozen or something again? Oh. Let's have L1 to throw a grenade. <laughs> Oh, L1 to arc the grenade. Incoming! And through there! Oh, come! I want to use this real quick. Really? Damn it. Oh, that's Sully. Durr. I was shooting at Sully. I had no idea.
Uh-oh. Boom. Damn, I'm good. Crap. God damn it. I couldn't cancel out. I couldn't figure out how to cancel out on my grenade. Shit. Help me, kid. You gotta take out the tower. I got you, Sully. Damn it. God damn it. Leave me alone. Eat that bitch. Kaboom! I thought that that sniper up on the ridge was a bad guy, but it was Sully. I accidentally kept shooting at him. Thank God friendly fire ain't a thing in this. Okay, you guys got anything good? Thank you. All right. Is there a way for me to get up here? Oh, come on. Seriously? There's got to be a way for me to get up here. Oh, duh. I knocked down a freaking plank for me to walk on. Should be this way. Yeah, this game is definitely a little bit longer and a little bit tougher, and so it should be a little bit lengthier of a series, maybe by a couple episodes. I got through Drake's Fortune in about seven. And Uncharted 4 in about oh, eight solid. streams. Look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. <clears throat> Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. 
Hey. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? Do let's. Wow, this place must be thousands of years old, at least. Down this way. Wow. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ugh. Ugh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. I think they're all that way. They must have taken refuge here during the tsunami. Huh. Whoa, what is that? There's gotta be some sort of clue around here. Ah! Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried their cargo all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. More resin. I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. Oh, that is so cool looking. That's very cool looking. Wait a minute. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the oh. blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. Uh, that's very ominous. Follow the blood stains, eh? Nothing over there. Goes this way. God, that is such a creepy looking <laughs> stone skull. Oh my god. Especially in this light. Seems to end at this wall. Yeah, that's odd. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Whoa. I think I hurt myself. <laughs> I think I hurt myself. Shut up, old man. You've taken sure worse. leads in here. More bodies. Oh my god. You know, maybe I'm crazy. But it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, Nate. You're just getting spooked. I say his... Spookedness is well warranted considering the last treasure you found was turning people into Nosferatus. Look at this. What do we have here? Careful. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding. Uh, I knew he was going to do that shit. <laughs> Whoa. Man, is that an ugly friggin' thing? What is it? Some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a perba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet, lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah, except it's not just a field of temples anymore. It's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Oh, yeah. Hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim Bears the golden passport. Oh, <laughs> right. Nice work, kid. So what are we waiting for? 
Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. <laughs> Let's get going. Uh, something bad's gonna be coming up soon. Always does. I'm gonna go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. <sighs> Uh, wait for me. I still don't trust you very much. Give me a hand, Nate. Oh, God. Oh, crap. Come on. Harry! In here! It's Drake! What the hell are- Get your hands up. She's only playing the part. If she's only playing the part. <laughs> and you, Victor, goddamn Sullivan, you still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? Couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. And a map. <laughs> they came from down there. Oh, Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps, between India and Tibet, one temple will reveal a pathway to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. <laughs> oh, no. Don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're going to wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. <sighs> Crap. Come on, keep moving. <sighs> oh, shit. Are you all right? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm going to try and buy you some time. Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. Run, run, run. Yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> Shit. They've spotted us. Run Damn for it. it. <laughs> Eat some of that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, Jesus. Come on, man. Climb. Do what you're best at. <laughs> Got no choice but to jump. Damn. Now what do we do? We jump? <laughs> Hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. We get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. Oh, come on, now don't you start this again. Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. <sighs> there they are! Oh, shit. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. <laughs> <laughs> You keep saying you're getting too old for it, Sully, and yet you keep joining him for the journey. When you said Lazarevich had a head start on us, you weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh, yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. Alright, you got it. Oh, shit. Uh -oh. 
got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better. On, man, this is where the demo picked up for Uncharted 2. Urban warfare. Oh, no. Hold left stick and press R2 to run a gun. Don't they ever give up? Ah! <laughs> Shit. Holy crap, man. Okay. The old market. How to be this way. Find him. Crap. <laughs> Go, go, go! He's here somewhere. Oh, he is. You just want to find him. Whoa! Took out one of them. Show your That's right. <laughs> okay. Now we just gotta find Chloe. While aiming, you're gonna press triangle to cancel. I thought that's how you did it before. I just forgot how to do it. The last, uh, last mission here. That's why I kind of messed that up. Got blown up by the grenade. So. Um, there is a way up here, and I just have to find it, that street sign, there we go. If there are any treasures around here and I'm missing them, I do apologize, but... I got a game to get through, I can't afford to be exploring every nook and cranny. Too much, anyway. <laughs> ha, that's a little bit of an Easter egg. Hotel El Dorado. That's funny. Oh, crap. Parking job. He dropped it all the way down there. You piece of crap. Clear the street. Huh. I'm really tempted to pick it up. Pick it up. I have to drop down here. Ooh, we're gonna be very careful here. Hey! Huh? 
Okay, there's no way I can take out the rest of these guys silently. Take that. These guys with the frickin' shields. Come on! How do I get around these guys with the damn shields again? I gotta like, circle around them and shit. Oh, son of a... I need a grenade. Got you, bitch. Do need to pick this up right here. That'd be a good idea. Whew, that was a little bit more intense than I remember it. It's those shield guys are real tricky to try to go up against because you really got to try to circle around them or get their ass end sticking out just to try to trip them up. There we go. There we go. Got plenty now. Oh, shit. Pull a smart move here and climb. Oh, shit! <sighs> Seems like I am always saving your ass. Well, thanks for that. Well, it is an ass worth saving. <laughs> 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 oh, is that an ancient Tibetan ritual dagger in your pocket? Huh, no, Maybe it's my I'm boner. To see <laughs> yeah, hello. <laughs> so this is the key to everything. Yes, it is. Supposedly. Marco Polo's passport to Shambhala. What do we do with it? Ah, they have no idea, actually. Um, insert dagger-based penis pun here. 
I wouldn't underestimate him, you know. He and Flynn have been tearing this city apart. They must have leveled dozens of temples already. So what's our next move? Nate? I hate it when you do that. <laughs> Check this out. You see the symbol? Yeah. Look up there. Okay, I see the resemblance, so what does it mean? It means we know how Marco Polo found his next clue. The temple we're looking for is going to be marked with this emblem. Now all we have to do is find it. <laughs> you do realize there are literally hundreds of these temples throughout the city. Yes, but if we found a higher vantage point... We could spot our needle in the haystack. Right. There's a hotel not far from here. <laughs> Chloe, now is not the time. It's easily the tallest building in the city. Right. Oh, okay. Right. Well, okay. That's, uh, that's good thinking. Follow me. Yep. Well, I think... Eh, got a couple more minutes here. Okay, there's a grenade here. There's a grenade. There's the grenade! Oh, it's there's locked. another grenade. It's locked. Wait here. I'll see if I can find a way around. And before I find that way around, I only got a few minutes left, and I think this is probably a good spot to cut the episode. So that is exactly what I'm going to do. So on the next episode, we are going to supposedly make our way to a higher vantage point to see where we need to go next. So in the meantime... Uh, my name is I'm the Dude Five, and this is I'm the Dude Games. Please subscribe to my channel and click that bell icon for notifications. Like this video as well as any others of mine that you enjoy, including the one I provide on screen. Also follow me on Twitter. I'll provide a link in the description below. As always, stay classy, and I will see you all out there.